almost 50 years ago when I was at school, there were, about two, there were two cars which I used to follow in interest as the Porsche Carrera RS and the BMW Batmobile. And uh, I remember seeing one um, owned by a friend who had painted his in the police colours. And it always, to me, seemed like one of the most spectacular cars possible on the road with its huge wings and spoilers and so on. And also at the time it was being run incredibly successfully by the BMW team uh, with the likes of Hans Stuck. And it wasn't until many years later that I came across one which was coming up for sale which was indeed the car that uh, BMW Motorsport Division's test car um, came available. And not only that, it's the one they handed over to Hans Stuck as his road car. And I found I, I couldn't resist it. Uh, one of the uh, amusing things was that, um, as I say, Hans Stuck uh, was its first uh, owner. He, he was given it to, given to him on the day he was photographed leaping um, of a Nürburgring in his race car. And, uh, and I was in touch with him. Uh, I was taking the car to Goodwood and I was in touch with him and he said he would come and not only drive it but also sign it. Unfortunately, he couldn't make it that year. There was some problem. But uh, I got photographs of him in the car with an old girlfriend of his, and uh, and he told me how it sort of fitted him like a like a glove, and I can absolutely understand that. It's, uh, it's a joy to drive. Once you're up to speed, it's, it's light, it's, it's responsive, it's got plenty of power, more power than the norm, usual, and, uh, and it's just a joy. I mean, and the, the advantage over the Carrera RS is you can take the whole family. When I first um, when, we, when I first came across it, and it's coming up for sale, um, I took my sons Merlin and Cosmo to to look at it, and they they got it. They they understood immediately what this car was all about, and uh, and they were you know they were only you know in their early teens then, and uh, but then I had an opportunity to take them to Goodwood, and um, the Duke asked if I'd like to take the car down there with the boys, and uh, so it was there. The first time they, well it wasn't the first time they drove around the track, but it's the first time they drove the car. And, uh, and being with them, driving a BMW Batmobile before they had a driving license around the track was, you know, that's an experience they'll never forget. And, uh, and the, the, the smiles on their faces and uh, driving around, driving very well actually. And, uh, and that meant a lot to me. That was a, uh, a special moment. But now there's, it's come to a point where they've been more sensible than me. Um, they feel that now's the time to, to see the car move on because they want to put the money into their houses. You know, they're, they're young 20 year olds and they, they're, being, they're being far too sensible.